In a bold move to strengthen its air force, Pakistan's aeronautical complex has just unveiled plans for a new twin-engine, fourth-generation fighter jet, the JF-17 PFX. Building on the success of the JF-17 Block III, this new platform is set to enter service in the 2030s, with development expected to wrap up by the end of this decade. The JF-17 PFX will share substantial compatibility with the JF-17 Block III, a jet co-produced with China. But this time, Pakistan is taking a big step with a twin-engine design, a shift that brings both new advantages and challenges. While the JF-17 PFX is expected to cost more to produce and operate, it brings a significant leap in performance. With features like a larger radar, greater weapons payload, extended range and improved flight dynamics, it promises enhanced maneuverability and the ability to fly at higher altitudes. The JF-17 PFX could even potentially achieve supercruise, flying at supersonic speeds without the need for afterburners, a capability that could put it on par with more advanced fourth-generation jets globally. The PFX will likely retain key weapons from the JF-17 Block III, including the Chinese-developed PL-10 and PL-15 air-to-air missiles, ensuring it remains a formidable threat in aerial combat. But here's the twist. The PFX isn't necessarily Pakistan's ultimate goal. Experts believe the PFX may be a stepping stone toward a true fifth-generation fighter as part of Pakistan's Project ASM, an ambitious plan to develop an indigenous stealth fighter. The JF-17 PFX could serve as a transitional program, helping Pakistan build the industrial and technological expertise needed for the next big leap a co-developed fifth-gen jet with China. While Pakistan works on the PFX, it's also expanding its fleet with more JF-17 Block III aircraft and the powerful J-10C, a four-plus generation fighter from China. The J-10C is a heavier, more expensive platform, but its advanced sensors and superior performance give it a clear edge over regional rivals like India's Su-30 MKI and Iran's Su-35s. And the plot thickens. In January, Pakistan confirmed ongoing negotiations to acquire China's J-35A, a fifth-generation twin-engine stealth fighter that could be a game-changer for Pakistan's air power. However, with the increasing number of twin-engine fighters in Pakistan's inventory, there are concerns about whether the country can sustain the costs of managing multiple twin-engine programs alongside its existing fleet. The rise of the JF-17 PFX represents a key part of Pakistan's strategy to maintain a competitive edge in the region, leveraging China's technological advancements while facing the challenges of domestic development. So, whether the JF-17 PFX will become a game-changer or simply a bridge to future capabilities, one thing is clear. Pakistan is determined to ensure its air forces remain at the forefront of modern combat aviation. What do you think about Pakistan's new fighter jet plans? Will the JF-17 PFX meet its goals or will it be a stepping stone to something even bigger? Let us know in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe for more military aviation updates. This version is more concise and keeps the viewer engaged with a smooth flow of information, using visuals to support the narrative. It also adds some intrigue by focusing on the future implications of these developments.